Go back to this first one. Doopa doopa. Does it work here? Doopa doopa. Yeah, it sure does. What about here? Doopa doopa. Kind of, but this note in the middle makes it weird. Doopa doopa. So you could, but not doopa. really, right? Doopa doopa. What about here? Doopa doopa. Doopa doopa. Doopa doopa. Doopa doopa. Doopa doopa. Uh, there's, a, there's another dot, dot, rough bark, bark. Yeah. So this. Count your measures, and if it's on a downbeat. It's doo -ba -doo -ba. This could be a doo ba doo ba because that works. Doo -ba -doo -ba. So then you have this one pickup first, so you could just a doo ba doo ba. Just add an a. Exactly. You leave it there with a snare, which is the way that you would do that. place so what I mean is to when we're doing this sort of multiple choice I'm giving you the key here which is to try that one first if it doesn't look like it fits then try a different one try Jesus so well <laughs> so let's so when we get here number 12 what do we have Ooh, a big quarter note right there on one just bop I don't understand it because of all the writing notes around that's it. yeah I'll wrote a bunch of stuff on my sheet and I didn't have a clean one to copy you but that's don't worry about that so this is just the same setup this is the ba ba, ba, right? ba. so don't worry about that do okay that do that doesn't work do ba do ba ba do ba do ba so even though there's nothing written there you could still use it which is what makes it so crazy even when there's one note the one note is on the end of four so you can use it Otherwise, Are you're doing you stuff like attention? this. Look at this. Look at this big old complicated thing. Uh, so this book teaches you to kind of play it like that, but this is so much simpler. This is not a book meant for beginning jazz students. Because the beginning jazz students. Because look at all this. That's, a, that's a lot. That? Like, ooh. Oh, I see. That's a 16th note triplet on the and of three. I think like, I see something. Does that, does these X's are high. Yeah. has a one, two, three... And like the end of four, I guess. So we can hats. we can talk about what to do with with extra time in a little bit, but you're gonna play that as a snare drum. Beat two is gonna go by, and on beat three, do ba do ba. That makes sense. Ba boom do ba. Three and four and. One two three and four and. Oh, how about this one? One two three and. Do ba, do ba. Oh, what do you know? It works right here, too. In fact, this one, I would play exactly the same as this one. Oh, yay. They just put a note on three. One, two, three. But I would play them the ba, same. Ba, one, two, three, and four, and... Mm -hmm. well, there's only w one more on this page that I want to talk about and today. number 14 or 15. Uh, oh, no, 15. 15 here at the bottom. So I mentioned bucket of fish, right? I think I said that oh, on Thursday. Fish. So that, angel. what kind of note is that? We don't use that very often in here. Uh, half note. Half note, you're right. Are half notes long or are they short? Uh, they take up two beats and have two half notes in a measure. Mm -hmm. If you clap it out, it's well, mm -hmm. one, so three. So in other words, it's longer than a quarter note. Yes. Right? Four quarter notes so are two half notes. you should you should put that where? So we should put it. Should you do it on a snare drum? Uh, should it be a bark? Uh, oh goodness! <laughs> yes. Okay. So I think you'll actually like this one. I thought without, this one was really cool. Metal when they hands, me. So, so we'll put a triplet up front. One, two, three, bucket three, of fish. So start with that. It's a triplet. Four triplet one. Uh, so where do you start? Four triplet one. So. Yep. Like, Very John I, Bonham. Yeah, I was gonna say that was like one of the first things we figured out. So you do bucket of fish, and then you crash with the hi hat. Or I mean, with the sorry, you crash for B two. I don't know why I said hi hat. One, two, 
sorry, I mean to bump your knee. It's fine. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Can we add the kick because, like, it's the... So look right here. That's your setup. Da ga da doo Because that's where your accent is. So, you ready for this? Oh, yay! What about here? What could work here? Ah! Dooba dooba! It wins again! So, watch this! Watch the party! Okay, you got your eyes on it? One, two, three. Da 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 do da do ba. So just make sure that because this is still ringing, don't make three huge. Da 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 do ba da do ba. That's how you're gonna get your accent here and your accent here. That's where you want your accents. So try that real slow. Da 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 do da 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 da. Dug a dagoon, da ding da ba. Don't go too fast. like a wild animal right now. Like just keep it keep it simple. Go slow. One more time. I think you're focusing more on goofing around with my foot than you are on listening. You're starting to play stuff that really sounds jazzy. That's you're playing like shop chorus kind of stuff with that. But rich. Uh, although I suppose shop chorus is more of a kind of a two beat, but but yeah, you're you're playing a big like hit section there. So, but that's when this stuff starts to, to sound really cool and gets really fun to play. I um. So we, we, you're getting like pretty much a, an hour lesson today, dude. You've been hanging in there pretty good. We're already over our 45 minutes. Um, I want to see, since we're already technically at time anyway, why don't you hang out in here a little bit? I'm going to run out to my car. I'm going to get some.